For five years, I had been seeing a kidney specialist and I had stage three chronic kidney disease where 60% of my kidneys were not functioning. I had lost 60% of the use of my kidneys. So I was told that I was going to either uh, eventually go on uh, dialysis and then ha end up having a kidney transplant at some point in my life in the future. My wife and I heard about Maldonado coming to um, West Palm Beach through our good friend, uh, Pastor Mario Bramnick. And we began to pray and believe God for a specific healing for my kidneys during that crusade. And the most amazing thing happened because when we were there, I got lost in the worship. And, and that's when I began to, to tell my wife, I think tonight I'm gonna be healed. And Pastor Apostle Maldonado came and, and he, he began to ask for people that had these kinds of issues. And we stood up in faith and we agreed with him in prayer for God's healing hand to touch these, these kidneys. How long have you been suffering that pain? About three years ago, I went to the doctor and they told me I had stage three chronic kidney disease. Yeah, you told me. I'd lost 60% of the use of my kidneys. But today, when this man began to pray with me and we came into agreement, I felt the power of God. Come on. I bent over and it felt like his hands, when he put his hands on my stomach, they went all the way through to my back. And as I bent over, I started to regurgitate and, and I just felt this heat that I've never felt before. Ah. And it felt like the, the healing hand of Come God on. coming Come through on. his hand. And that night when I went home, I told my wife, I said, I'm convinced that, that we received healing. A few weeks later, I ended up going to the hospital. I had been fatigued for three days. I had lost 27 pounds and I could barely walk into the hospital room and they put me in ICU immediately and began to pump insulin into me because my blood sugar was at 667. They told my wife, because of his stage three chronic kidney disease and all the records that you have, she took everything with her. They said he will either have brain damage or he will not make it. And she began to pray in the spirit. They came into the ICU room with a, with a cart to do an ultrasound and my wife is sitting next to my bed while they're doing the ultrasound on my kidneys. And she was watching the screen and listening to the text say, it's unbelievable. The documentation that you have of stage three chronic kidney disease and the ultrasound don't match up. He has perfect kidneys. He has kidneys of an 18 year old. There's nothing wrong with them. They're perfectly formed. They're, they're functioning at 100%. What happened to him before he came in here to make his kidneys so pure and so functioning? And the doctors documented this and said, this is remarkable. It can be nothing other than a healing. They told my wife I was either gonna pass away or have brain damage. I think, I think she told him I already had brain damage. But I lived and six days later, I walked out of that hospital with the resurrection power of the Holy Ghost in me. And I thank God, I praise God that he's still in the business of healing people today.